Hello there. Well, it's early evening here in New Plymouth now. The sun is getting ready to set, so I have to make the most of what light I have got left. Anybody who's been watching my videos for a while now knows that I do like to uh, film these pictures in natural light. I've tried using artificial lighting and I just hate the shadows. So I'm going to try another snub nose blow dry um, blow over paint pouring and use my new toy, my mini leaf blower as well to see what I can create. And the colours I am going to be using are Midnight Blue, Dark Turquoise and Rose. And I'm also going to use a little of my Silver with Rose added, which I had in an earlier video, and um, just for a bit of metallic. Okay, and of course white around the edge. So I'm going to start by putting my colours down across the board and then, because a foam board that I'm using today, again attached to the um, cooling rack with uh, poster party, blue tack we call it here in New Zealand to keep it from moving around. Okay, so I'll put my colours on the board. I am going to, um, uh, sorry, torch before I use my blow dryer as I can see quite a few bubbles on here. Now I've put another pillow of white down like I like to do but again rather than doing the Dutch pour style I'm just going to blow that across with the colours and I'm going to try and do them opposite each other if I can. that's it. That is my picture. Um, I'll just give it another torch. Um, I think it probably would have been a better idea for me to pop some silicone in to uh, create a few cells but it's good a good idea now and then to do a picture or two that hasn't got any cells at all. All I'm getting are tiny little dots from the bubbles. But that is just lovely. Very pleased with that. That was a test of um, using those two tools together. And for the follow-up to this, in this video, um, tomorrow I am going to do another um, blow dryer pour, but with the snub nose instead of the tapered end um, and probably a little bit of silicone added to the colours to see what a difference that makes. So I'll see you tomorrow. 
Well, we've got a very wet day here in New Plymouth today. I'm going to do another snub nose blow dryer swipe today. I'm using up the colours that I had in, the, in, a, in previous pours. Uh, I've got a little bit left each of rose. Turquoise and navy uh, and some silver with rose mixed in it but um, they've got silicone in them so uh, I just want to see how I get on doing another stub nose pour with those colours and I'm just going to dot them onto the piece of foam board and see what happens. I blobbed that. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to put my white pillow on, but I think I'll put it through the centre as well and break up that colour. I'm not putting the white on to do the Dutch pour. I'm putting the white on to help the paint to move across the board better. Now to use the snub nose of my dryer and just run it smoothly over the paint. That piece there, just run it smoothly over the paint to swipe it across. pleased with the way that's come out so far um, but I'm going to use my toy now to just do a little more definition I think my toy might be making mud rather than definition. <sighs> might snub nose it again, see if I can avoid avoid the mud. It's given me a little more colour mix. Well, here are the two pictures side by side. The one on the left being the one without silicone, which I did last night, and the one on the right being the one with silicone and using less, less paint. And I can tell you straight away which one I like better. But it's good for me to experiment with these things and also to experiment with the different ways that I can use the blow dryer. <laughs> 